And relatives of two people killed in Miller County tell us they're all safe tonight. We've been following the case against JT McLean for weeks now. Law enforcement says McLean killed himself Wednesday night in Dakota Dunes, South Dakota, by the Iowa border. That's where relatives of Miller County couple Pam and Daniel Stefan live. Two people law enforcement think McLean killed. ABC 17 news anchor Lucas Geiser continues investigating the case after getting details on some of the latest evidence. Investigators there in South Dakota and here in Iowa have been putting together evidence that they've found in the death investigation of JT McLean. Today I got my hands on new details that Iowa police have put together that investigators in Missouri might use. A search warrant from Sioux City Police show officers took fingerprints and DNA swabs of McLean's body. We told you yesterday about Union County Sheriff's deputies finding a bloody cord and rubber straps in the truck McLean died in. Boone County Sheriff's Captain Brian Lear says his agency is working with Miller County and the State Highway Patrol to pick that evidence up. Family of Pam and Daniel Stefan in South Dakota tell me they're still grieving. Law enforcement took them into hiding when they learned McLean was in the area. A former neighbor of the Stefans in Union County tells me she was shocked to hear they were the victims of a homicide, remembering them as kind people. Lucas Geisler, ABC 17 News, Sioux City, Iowa.